Toyota Estima Airs V6 Engine 3.5 cc The car model year 2014 to 2016 car problem is engine power loss, poor acceleration and jerk in while driving. Engine misfire when starting car engine. Backfiring. Illuminated check engine light The vehicle has trouble starting the engine. The problem with this car is when the car engine starts, the check engine light comes on and when the air condition on, engine shaking. Also, when you press the accelerator while driving, engine shuddering as if the engine is about to shut down. Car engine has no power, how to solve these problems so you can watch the full video inshallah, to help you troubleshoot this vehicle, you can check with the scan computer to find out what caused the check engine light to come on. We'll check the engine code with the scan computer. The engine code is P0352 ignition coil B primary slash secondary circuit The common cause of this code is the ignition plug coil not working. You need to know first that the B means the number 2 plug coil. For those who do car repair work like me, we all know that V6 engine has two cylinder heads, one at the front and one at the back. I am giving you an idea to know where is Toyota V6 engine B number ignition plug coil or number 2 ignition plug coil very easily. The Toyota Istima V6 engine has 3 ignition coils in the rear cylinder head and 3 ignition coils in the front cylinder head. I show you where the Toyota V6 engine ear number 1 ignition coil is located. The rear cylinder head has a number 1, 3 and 5 ignition coil from the timing site. Note that the front cylinder head has ignition coils number 2, 4 and 6. Remember, if there is a problem with your car the ignition coil coil, what code will come? For example, number 1 ignition coil code P0351, number 2 P0352, number 3 P0353, number 4 P0354, number 5 P0355, Number 6P0356, these codes will come then you will understand which plug coil is the problem. The engine code of this car is P0352, this the engine code means there is a problem with the number 2 plug coil. How to test Toyota 4 pin ignition coil wiring diagram with multimeter number 1 we're positive supply, plus, voltage is in number 4, we're ground body earth. You can use a multimeter to test the ignition coil wire. Set the multimeter to DC voltage. When checking, the ignition switch must be on. Connect the multimeter red cable to the number 1 wire of the ignition coil socket, and the multimeter black cable to the car body or battery negative side. The multimeter 12 battery voltage is supplied. The wiring is OK. 12 if there is no voltage. Check if there is a wiring problem and repair it. Turn the ignition switch off to check the ground body connection set the multimeter to the ohm position bipping sound. Connect the red wire of the multimeter to the number 4 pin of the ignition coil socket. Connect the black wire of the multimeter to the negative site of the car body or the battery of the car. First on the front cylinder head, it's number 2 ignition coil, rear cylinder head first number 1 ignition coil, rear middle number 3, front middle number 4. In rear last it is number 5 ignition coil, in front last it is number 6 ignition coil. I did ignition coil wiring test but this car ignition coil wiring harness no problem. Ignition coil according to the engine code of this vehicle number B or 2 is the problem, so I will open this ignition coil to change it. Remove the old ignition coil and install the new ignition coil. After installing the new ignition coil, connect the wire socket and tighten it with a screw. When the ignition coil is fully installed, remember to clear the engine code before starting. With the ignition switch on I will clear the engine code with the scan computer. To clear the engine code I would press clear the field code. OK engine code clear complete now again check if there is engine code then click for red fault code OK done clear no fault code. Now I will start the car engine check if the car engine light is on and if the car engine is shaking or not.
The car engine, the check engine light is no longer on, the engine no longer shakes when the air condition of the car is on, and the engine no longer shakes when the accelerator is pressed while driving, inshallah, thank you all for watching the video, if you like the video, please subscribe the channel. If there is any problem to understand, let me know in the comment box. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.